Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks yet again, and today we're going to continue with the IFV. Now, there are a few things that do need to be added to this thing and changed about this thing, so that is what we're going to do today. Ignore what I'm wearing in the webcam, I have a dressing gown on, I have a ice hockey jersey, and I've got a jumper underneath. Uh, because it's cold! Needs must, you know? Needs must. Anyway, what we're going to do today is we're going to modify this thing. Um, essentially, we need to make it go a little bit quicker, we need to change gears, etc. Uh, we also actually need, um, to make the water thing work, because currently we stall out in the water. Again, gears, but that's okay. We need some rear lights, and I also want to move the exhaust from the front to the rear. So, that's what we're going to work on today. I might also actually change this hinge from being on the side to being on the bottom, uh, because a lot of you guys have said I should do that. So, I probably will. Anyway, let's go ahead and get on with it, shall we? Alright, so starting out then, let's go ahead and try and add some rear lights. That seems like the best option anyway, so uh, I think we'll actually do it vertically. Um, it might be a weird way of doing it, but it might not, so we'll see. Anyway, lights. Let's see if we can do this. Light, hang on. Have I deleted anything in order to do that? I don't think I have. Let's get the right color and actually just slap it in. So, one light. Okay, good. Two lights, three lights. There we go. I think we need three lights. Maybe. Uh, right, okay. So, now that we've done that, let's go ahead and change the color of said lights. Uh, the top ones are going to be our indicators. There we go. Uh, middle ones are going to be our uh, brake lights. And then the bottom ones are going to be our reverse lights. I'm assuming a tank has those. I actually don't know. Um, I also actually feel like doing this. There we go. Because I feel like that actually looked better. So, let's go to the back and see what that looks like. A little bit strange, but it'll do. It will do! In fact, actually, if we delete this one, um, we can probably get away with actually adding a paint block on there. So let's grab this color, go ahead and grab a paintable sign, whack it in there, and um, paint diagonally across. Here we go, so grab this one. There we go, good. Go ahead and paint all of this in, and honestly, I think this will look pretty good in the end. So uh, change this color, bam, bam. And that looks pretty good. I like it. So grab this. Go ahead and copy it. Come over to the other side. Go ahead and press U. Paste it. Merge it. And we'll be good to go from there. All right. Spawn it in. Let's see what that looks like. Hopefully that'll look good. Yeah, it looks okay. That's fine. Um, I'm a bit... I don't know. I feel like we should make this bit gray as well and leave this bit as is. I'm not so sure about that though. So we'll probably leave it for now. We'll probably leave it. Um, I need to grab that. Okay. So we're going to cut this. Uh, I need to bring it this way. I need to flip it around and stuff, and that actually has to go there. Which is unfortunate, because that's in the way. Uh, okay, but if we paste this here... Um, we'll move these, these guys around. So, um, in fact, I can just put these guys back in, that's fine. Okay, actually, do 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 cut this, move it in, paste it there, that's fine. Paste, good. Merge this with this, merge this with this, and that is actually still okay. We're then going to go ahead and grab the edge pieces. Uh, like this, there we go, whack those in. We're then going to grab these guys and put them on this side. Here we go, yes. And then we need to put something in the middle, which um, is sort of just a button. We need, we need a button in the middle. So let's do that. Button, yes. Toggle button, yes. Bam. Okay, so whack this to... Uh, a switch box. That's what we need. Um, so yeah, because I've deleted certain things, uh, we need to now put those things back in. A little bit annoying, but I think that's fine. Anyway, delete this. In fact, let's have it on both sides. We might as well make it symmetrical. Uh, whack that in there. There we go. Awesome. And we only need to use one of them. So connect this to there. Connect this to here. And that's it. Okay, so when it's on, press 1. Go. Alright, let's see if this works. So it should fall down now. There we go. Now you have to jump in and go in. A little bit annoying, I'm not going to lie. I feel like that's not as good, but we can leave it like that for now. Sure, why not? All right, so the next thing that I wanted to do was actually to add something that resembles a tow bar kind of thing. So we're going to go ahead and attach that right there. We're going to get ourselves a connector, and we're going to attach this directly under there like that. I think that's honestly okay. We'll leave it just as is. That's fine. Uh, right, okay. Exhaust is our next issue. So, this is where things get a little bit tricky, uh, because it does either have to go... Oh, actually, we can push it through there. Oh, this is lucky. Okay, delete that. Delete this guy, 
and fill this in. One, two. Okay, good. Uh, we're going to have to have it go backwards here, down through there, and then backwards from there. That is okay. That is just fine. Okay, so delete these guys. Delete it going this way. Delete it going all the way at the back right here. And I guess we, we, we'll be able to figure it out back here. That's fine. Okay, so grab one of these to begin with. Go ahead and have it in the sky, just like so. Bring it this way. Yep, I'm going to have to paint it once we get in the inside, but I'm sure that's okay. Whack that in there. Yes. Whack that in there. Okay, awesome. And if we can send this backwards, just like so, uh, it should be fine. It should be anyway. Um, if we angle it downwards, we might be able to do something with it. So grab this. Go ahead and put it on there, just like so. And then I think we can get away with doing this. Fluid. Actually, air. If we type in air, I might have a filter. Here we go, one of these. Um, Bosh. <laughs> I know that looks weird, but I think it'll work. Okay, now we need to go to the inside and try and figure out how to attach these guys together. Because it's all wrong. It's all wrong. Okay, here we go. Bosh. Okay, delete that one. Mm -mm -mm. Bosh. There we go. Grab a straight line. Whack it in directly in there. Bosh. There we go. Nice. So now, uh, all of that should work. That should be fine. Good. Next thing. Uh, we're going to change the gear ratio on one of these to be more. Five to two. Five to two. Go. Let's see if this works. It might work. It might also not work. We'll see. So let's jump inside. I need to put that two-sided button, but that's fine for now. Get inside of here. Turn this on. Do this. Go. So our speed last time only got up to 15. And it was really annoying at 15. Now we're getting up to almost 80. I need a longer runway. But, you know, it's actually fast enough. Our exhaust also working. So that's good. <laughs> I mean, it looks weird, but it is working. Yeah, okay, right. Get us in the water, see if that works. Here we go. ba 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 bum ba bum Whee! All right, here we go. You ready? In the water we go. Awesome. Go! Am I... There's a hole. <laughs> Am I... There's a hole in this... In this situation somewhere. I don't know where it is, but I'm dying. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Get it out of there. Why am I dying and tell me? Why am I dying, please? Please tell me. Somebody said that there was a hole left in here. And you are correct, because this is a hole right there. So uh, I'm assuming that that goes straight through to the water and will die. Uh, which is annoying, but that's okay. So, jerk this, bam. There we go, jerk that, bam. This, sure. This, yes. Okay, everything's jerked. Um, this battery's going to come out. And we're going to replace it with this. This battery's going to come out. We're going to replace it with that. Now it should work. I think. Unless that is letting water in, which I I mean it might be, actually. It might be. But if we delete that, we don't have one. Oh, then we're fixed. Okay, good. <laughs> we're going to have it like that. That's fine. Okay, grab this color. Go ahead and do this. Bosh. I need to do the same on both sides, don't I? So delete that one. Grab this. Put it in properly. Grab a color. Paint it, and we should be good. Bosh. Okay, let's see what this does. It might work. It might not work. We'll see. Um, also, actually, sorry. Go to da, 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 this gearbox and make it less. We're going to go a two to one. We're also going to do two to one here as well. Bosh, bosh. Good. Um, because I don't know where it actually comes out of here. So it comes out of this and then goes straight backwards. Okay, right. So the gearboxes aren't attached to the gearboxes in the front. Is more what I was trying to get to. Anyway, jump inside. Close it back up. Unless I left the door open last time. Did I? I don't think I did. Anyway, let's go. Oh, it's so much nicer. This thing is looking sick. I really like it. All right, here we go, guys. This is the time uh, to see if it works. All right, so essentially the water will come in straight away if we have an issue with it. The water is coming in straight away. There is a hole somewhere in here. Is it this situation? Is it that situation? I don't know. I feel like I didn't mess with an awful lot in order to make a hole, but I did, apparently. Apparently there's a hole in this now. Uh-oh. Oh. oh I, I know where the hole is. It's this. It's this situation right here. Okay, right. Sorry. 
Uh, I didn't notice it when I put it in, but yes, it makes sense. It made sense when we did it. Anyway, put that right there. There we go. Delete this. Delete this. We're going to put these guys on both sides, just like so. And uh, that'll be fine. So merge that back in. Merge this back in with this. And fill this in the middle. Da -da 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 -da. Boop. Okay, bit strange, but it will work. That actually makes it better as well, because I don't know why, why I thought it would be smaller. But clearly, it's going to be the same size. And honestly, that actually looks pretty good. I like that. Nice. Uh, so now, it will be uh, sealed. And because it is sealed, uh, we can now take it into the water and it'll be fine. So let's do that yet again. Here we go. Alright, here we go, guys. Here we go. Jump off here. Whee! There we go. And into the water straight away. Okay. Splash down. Very good. And drive. I feel like we need to be a little bit more buoyant. <laughs> Look at it. It is wheeling, boy. That's not right. That's not right at all. Okay, hang on. How fast are we going in the water? 16. I'm matching our land speed. That's crazy. Okay, now fuel's not going down an awful lot either. That's insane. Okay, well, can we still move, like, actually drive in the water? Yes, we can. Oh, my goodness. Holy jeebus. No, 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 no. If the water gets in where the turret is... If the water level gets higher than the turret, it fills. So what we're going to do, actually, is get ourselves some pivots. And uh, we're going to go ahead and shove them in here. Now, you might be wondering why. In fact, I'm going to get rid of this. And I'm going to put that in there. And I'm going to put another one above it. There we go. And then I'm also going to put some in here. So let's do that. Uh, I can't tell where I even am. I can't tell where I even am. Um, it doesn't matter where inside they are, so we're going to go ahead and put them there. And put one in there as well. Okay, so now it should be way more buoyant, which is good. Um, but yeah, it's fine. Okay, so for now, that's okay. I don't know whether to add, like, bilge pumps or anything like that. I don't think I should, so I'm not going to. But, like, I could. Uh, and I feel like because I could, I maybe should, but I don't know. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of all that. There we go. And this. Spawn it in. Let's see what that looks like. I like I like the color scheme, by the way. I really do. Um, that looks a bit weird, but I think it'll work. Okay, so um, we should add more to the back. I, I feel like, honestly, we should add a railing um, to the rear, back here somewhere. So we're going to go with one of, one of these, actually. And we're going to make it that color. That's fine. And we're going to do this with it, I feel. Yeah, there we go, like that. If I could have put another one on, I would have, but that's too much. <laughs> that is actually too much. So we're going to leave it sort of as is. There we go, like that. Spawn that in, let's have a little look. Yeah, okay, it adds a little bit of detail to the back, and I think that's, that's fine. Okay, so, now that we've done all of that, let's go ahead and add a tow bar back on, because uh, I wanted one, originally. So we're going to go and have another one. Here we go, connector! Whack that on there, and do this. Wash. Alright, there we go. There we go. That is mighty fine. Um, what else was there that I actually wanted to do today? I don't think there was very much, to be honest. Um, a lot of you guys said that I should do a smoke screen properly, uh, in terms of actually having it, like, be able to pop <laughs> and, and cover us. So what we might do is actually put them here. I, legit, I actually kind of like that, but not really, but kind of. Um, I, I would have liked to have hidden them within the tank itself, but I don't think I can really do that. Actually, maybe I can. There's nothing going in there on the inside, is there? So I can probably get away with that. Yeah, okay, right. Let's say we go ahead and do this then. So, uh, smoke, yes. Infrared. Uh, smoke. Uh, 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 I guess we won't be able to see it if that's the case, though, will we? So, let's go with... Let's go with white smoke for now. Alright, and I'm gonna do... I'm gonna do all of them like this. Okay. Alright, so now that we've done that then, let's go ahead and have a little look on the inside of here. There we go, jump inside. Let's go ahead and close this up. And, uh, I'll show you guys what I've actually done here. So, I've changed one to just fire flares. Okay, the ones on the side only fire flares. So, if we press one... 
A flare fires out of each side. If you press one again, a flare fires out of each side. If you press one again, we get another flare and another flare. There you go. I kind of need to increase the amount of thingy on those, don't I? I do. Anyway, let's turn ourselves around if we want a smoke screen. This is only a single use, by the way. Go ahead and press two. Yeah, the smoke in this game ain't it. <laughs> the smoke in this game just isn't it. But that's okay. Anyway, let's go see if our extra buoyancy actually works now. Let's go ahead and take it into the water. And uh, we'll see. Right, here we go. Straight in. Oh, splash down. I mean, it's okay. It's not the best still. The only other thing that I can think of doing, which actually might work really well, um, is actually adding some control surfaces. These little tiny ones. Alright, hidden within the actual beast. Hidden within the beast. One, two, uh, maybe even quite low. As low as I can put them. Oh, this is as low as I can put them. There we go. We're going to go and put those there. And then we're going to do, what, another three, four at the back? Four there. Okay. I think that's probably enough. Maybe do another one. And another one. Alright, go. Nice. Alright, I'm actually really happy with this. I I'm very, very happy with this. Um, we should probably add some paint blocks and stuff on the front. Give it some sort of um, flag or something like that. But honestly, I'm actually really happy with the way this is. Um, we do need the lights, of course, to work. Um, so we will end up doing that. But um, yeah, I'm actually really happy for now. Alright, let's see if that actually helped with anything. I, I, I feel like it will have, to be honest. I feel like it will have helped with something. So let's take it into the water. There we go. Alright, nice. And it stays level. It actually stays... Yes, this is about right. Okay, excellent. So, we're going to leave it like that, to be honest. We are going to leave it like that. We can't do too much tight turning, but it works. It actually works. That's awesome. Alright, cool. Well, we can turn on the spot. Let's go ahead and jump inside this gun. In fact, turn the light on first. Jump inside the gun. Let's go ahead and zoom in. Whoa, see if we can hit a target. Let's try and hit... I don't know, let's just go with the hanger for now. I mean, it's possible. That looks sick. That actually totally works. I'm so happy with it. Okay, if we then go ahead and we try and fire the rockets... sick. Okay, I'm actually really pleased with this. I think it's really cool. Anyway, for now, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.